Hello everyone, in this video we're going to look at the steps to install the Windows 10 November 2019 update on your computer using the Update Assistant tool. This time around it appears that Microsoft is not going to update the tool, so this option is only going to help you to upgrade an older release to the latest build of the May 2019 update and then you will need to use Windows Update to download and install in a small package that will switch the installation to the November 2019 update. If you are already running the May 2019 update, you can install the November update from Windows Update. This process should take less than five minutes. So if you want to use the Update Assistant to upgrade your computer, follow these steps. Go to the Microsoft Download website and click the Update Now button. I will be leaving the link in the video description so you don't have to pause the video to copy the link. Start the tool. Click the Update Now button and now click the Next button. Just keep in mind that this process can take some time depending on your internet connection and hardware. Also before proceeding, with any installation of Windows 10, it is always a good idea to disconnect any peripherals including external storage and printers to avoid installation problems. In addition, make sure to create a backup in case of something goes wrong and you need to roll back. I have a video tutorial on how to backup your device and I will be leaving the link in the video description below. Now just click the Restart Now button. Once installation completes, click the exit button and now we can check on system about that we're actually running version 19.03 and because version 19.03 and version 19.09 are pretty much the same, the only thing that we need to do to switch to the new version is just to go to the Windows Update settings and check for updates to install a small enablement package. If you don't see it the first time, to install any available updates and then restart your computer. Once the computer rebooted, open the settings app and then go to update and security and on windows update you should now see the option to download the package that switches your installation to version 1909 if you see the option click it and i'm not going to pause the video here so you can see how fast is to upgrade from version 19.03 to version All right, so that's pretty much it. I'm gonna restart the computer. And that's it. Now you can double check that you're running 1909 by opening settings and then going to system and on the about page, you should now read version 1909. And that's all there is to it. Remember to like the video, leave your comments, subscribe to the channel if you haven't done that yet. And I just hope this video was informative for you and I would like to thank you for viewing.